check out my pizza rat pizza oven with a terracotta dome the funnest pizza maker you'll ever find number one portable countertop pizza maker in Europe in my kitchen today we've had this for a while you might have saw it today I thought about making a pizza and then I said why not take out my everything bagels and make pizza bagels see they slide in that door there can you see that from there it comes with all kinds of spatulas and attachments and you can make dough and cut them like personal pan size you know with that ring that comes with it it has these little frying pans that come with it or little hors d'oeuvres or whatever you want to make put your jazz on there stick it in there five minutes it's preheated right now it's about 450 degrees it's really cool it has these a couple of these it comes with you know there's a dual heating element. There's a heating element below the pizza stone. That's another thing. There's a Janie Wine pizza stone in here. Look. There's a heating element below it and a heating element on top of it. It's a little bit seasoned, but the more you use it, it's going to change color because it'll be seasoned. This is a heavy terracotta dome. Very nice. So, without wasting any more time, I'm going to assemble a pizza bagel and everything bagel I'm going to put it in there in about six minutes it'll be nice all right so with the hole in the bagel I think I'm going to put a piece of pepperoni on there what do you think of that <laughs> block that up you want to make one I'm going to make pepperoni okay what sure. kind do you want I'll make a plain with cheese and sauce all right you make it how you like your pizza so I'm going to cover that hole so the sauce don't drip out isn't that nice I'll put a couple of them there. That's a great idea. Yeah, I like that idea. This is a fun pizza oven. We could put a full-size pizza in there, too, which I might do later in the week. You just take the lid off, get my pizza peel, which I have over there, slide it under that element. Be careful of that element because it's very hot, but it works great. So you love these in Europe and Italy. Look, I'm almost done. I'm going to put sauce and cheese and pepperoni on top. Come on over and make yours. We'll, make, we'll use the sauce together. You're gonna use the sauce, right? Yep. Nice. I'm almost ready. Freddy. This is a nice, fat, fluffy, everything bagel. Yeah. But I think I will use a little. Oh, to clog your hole up there. <laughs> a little piece so of pepperoni out. on the hole because I think that was a good yeah. idea. Now, this is hot all over. So I'm just going to be careful. Mm -hmm. Let me get this back on my plate. Oh, you want a plate? There's a plate there for you. Put sauce on. I'll show you. You want me to go close up? I Maybe, think. and then I'll show yeah. yours. Okay. That sounds good. Just like you make of the pizza. <laughs> I'm glad I thought of that so it's not going to leak out. <laughs> yeah, that's a great idea. <laughs> I'm a the pizza guy. Mm. Not too much of the sauce. Imagine having a party. You can all sit around the table and you all have your own spatula. Stick it in these holes. How many holes are there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Wouldn't that be fun? Yeah, everybody could use their own toppings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, look. That's mine. You can use that spoon, maybe. <laughs> Take some mozzarella, freshly shredded. And if you don't have bagels, you can get bread. And if you don't have a pizza oven, you get some bread or a bagel, make a pizza out of it. Stick it in your toaster oven or your frying pan. All right. You're a good chef when you do things like this. You can invent different things to eat. We'll put these in at the same time. I'll let you build yours. Okay. More pep. I wonder if Colin's watching me. Watching me, Colin? Got your picture back there. Can you see it? Where's Colin? And Adrian. And Adrian. There they are. So your mommy make you a bagel pizza. <laughs> or on a waffle, maybe. All right, build yours. There's mine, look. Beautiful. I can't wait to put that in there. All right. You make yours special. All right. One piece of pepperoni. One piece of pepperoni. <laughs>
pepperoni. And then, then I'll add the sauce just like you did. Sometimes you like cheese on the bottom and sauce on top, right? Maybe like, I'll make one. Like the colonial restaurant <laughs> does that? Yeah. Do that on a second one. Do you like uh, that? Okay, yes. Who else does it? Eastern Baking Company. Oh, yeah, that's the, the tomato down. pie. No, they put the cheese down first. And yeah. sauce on top. Well, I think Steve's Pizza does that too, one of our is favorites. Is that actually called a tomato pie or something? Tomato pie, or some places make Sicilian that way. So we got the cheese first on that one, sauce on top. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be different. But you have to also add your seasonings. I'm glad we got a dozen bagels because we're going to be eating for the next hour or so. All right, I'm going to put a little oregano. Oh yeah, I forgot my spices. Yeah. Okay, and what we have here, this is from one of my friend's uh, businesses. It's everything bagel seasoning. Yeah. It's, it's from Do You Bake. I like everything bagels. Now. Yeah, I can. You can actually put it on everything. And this bagel. has all the seasonings that you get on a everything bagel. I'm going heavy. Going mm. heavy, Pam. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm going to leave it a little bit of close up on that oven. All right, I'm hand. gonna. I'll okay. Put, I'll put it on the side here. You want to put them both in? Yours too? Mm hmm. Yay! I'll be on the camera for you. And if you use these metal ones, if you use these, you could just leave it in there and let it cook on there. You know? Comes with a bunch of attachments, but we're gonna use a plastic mini peel. Oh, yours looks good. Yours looks better than mine. I better put some in. Uh, I got dress oregano. It up. Dress it up. Oregano. I'll put that bagel seasoning on there because it looks good. We're going to get toasty in there. Okay, let's see. Going in the door. You put it in one door, you put it in another door. Everybody get it? Look at this. <laughs> on that hot stone. It's been preheated for about 15 minutes. You might get some cheese dripping off there, but what good pizza oven doesn't have some cheese stuck to it? Huh? That's mine. Oh, it's so fun! <laughs> you go on this side. Slide it off, see? And this one will go back here. Oh, nice. Oh. Enough room for all of them in there? Yeah. Yep. Now how long are you going to leave them About in? About six or seven minutes. Check the time. 6.16. Mmm, I think I almost smell it because it's so hot in there. Yeah. It smells like toasty bagel crust. <laughs> I only use one pizza peel, mini peel. Mm. I don't want to open the dome. I don't know if you can zoom in there though, can you? Maybe if I go down lower here. Because if I open the dome, I'll let that, I'll let all that nice heat yeah. in the brick oven. The atmosphere in there will change. The terracotta oven. Mm. And it's hot. Down here is not hot, but I wouldn't touch it. If you have your family around the table taking food in and out of there, just be so careful. That ring's probably hot. I'm not going to touch that. I like it. Slide them around a little bit. Look at that. Like the pizza guy. Ugh. Did you ever work in a pizza shop? I uh, worked at Domino's. <laughs> <laughs> Look at. Did you make them? Yeah, a couple times. I'm mostly delivering. Look at. Move around a little bit. Like to get the nice hot spot in the oven. Yeah. This is fun. Mm -hmm. Look, that's yours. Look. Oh, let me see close. 
Oh, I love Get that. that. This Seasoning smells so good. Doesn't it smell so good? Yes, it smells great. Okay. It actually smells like we're making real pizza dough. Yeah. <laughs> All right, it's been four minutes. <laughs> you got like two or three more minutes to go, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Is the cheese melting yet? Yeah. Yeah. I hear a little crackly sizzle in there. Beautiful. We'll be back. Pizza Red. Let's open the lid. Whoa. You can stop this anywhere you like. I like mine a little more crunchy. I don't know if you can see that. It's sizzling and crunching. And you could take yours off if you don't want them as crunchy. How do you like yours? I want mine not as crunchy as yours. Okay, well, I'd say they're done right now, but we could make them a little more well done. What do you think? Yeah. How's that look to you? That looks perfect. Can you see the bottom at all? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Looks crunchy. I think. <laughs> look what happened to yours! <laughs> We got extras, so you don't mess around with it. That's okay. Want to patch it up? Is it upside down? Oh, no. No, oh, it's fine. Just get it out. I think uh, I'm ready to eat mine. Okay, get them out and we'll, we'll taste them. Yeah. Time to eat. Look at that beautiful pizza bagel. We're really not supposed to take the lid off just no. to show them, right? Yeah, but I wanted to show you that you can... Keep taking them out and judge how you like it. Just it. Look at that. That's yours. Oh, that's great. Oh, <laughs> it's slippery. All right. Where's my second one? It's in the front. It's on this side. Isn't this fun? Yeah, that Look pizza that. peel works good. Imagine you could put grilled cheese in there. How's that? Or BLT or anything you want like and that. And pineapple. What are the, uh, <laughs> the tortilla wraps or what do you call them? Yep. Uh, oh, the taste. tortilla shells. Yeah. The flour tortilla shells we could put in there. And What's the go. one you cut like a pie? Is that a case of quesadilla or something like that? Mm hmm. All right. This is going to be okay yet. Yeah. Let me get that out for you. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> it's still good. It's still good. Yeah, that's great. It looks wonderful. All right. Let's turn this off. Let these cool a couple minutes. All right. We don't want to burn our mouths, though, do we? No, we don't. Close ups. Mm. Remember, everything bagel. Wow, look at it. Wow, nice. Can I see that a minute? Oh, that's nice and crispy. Now you want mine, huh? No, I don't want yours, but it worked out nice to have that pepperoni over the Oh, the sun. hole, yeah. Yeah, because nothing came out of the bottom. <laughs> we seasoned our stone a little better today. The more you use it, the more it gets seasoned, you know that, but it wouldn't have been good having sauce dripping all down through there. <laughs> I don't want to get the dreaded pizza blister. No, we don't want that. But I don't want to taste it. But that everything bagel seasoning. Wow, look at the bottom. Oh, it's yeah. still smoking. You think it's safe? Oh. Mm. Oh, oh my God! That's like a regular, perfect pizza crust. Mm. And it was a bagel. Bagel flavor, but all that mm. seasoning on there. One of our viewers said something about we should put a garlic in the pizza crust. Mm. But that's a, that's what this tastes like. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. There's so many things you could do here. Like I said, grilled cheese or or different flavor of bagel or. Just bread, bread crust. Yeah. Right? We or could. also do this in your toaster oven if you don't have one of these today. Mm hmm. Mm. But it does make a, a crispiness that Ooh. you wouldn't. Oh, I'll be careful with that. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, that's 180 degrees. Here's 130. Okay. Well, I'm going to take my time with this. Okay. I just wanted to taste it well. Mm -hmm. While everybody was still here. Because <laughs> you're going to take mine when I turn this on. No, I'm thinking this <laughs> is good. Thanks for watching us. This is delicious and fun. Mm. 
he can't wait no matter no. what. <laughs> We're gonna make some more. Yeah, and I, I think... will make a full size in there. I will, I think. Yep. Huh. Not today. Not today. But this is great for today. We could do we could do breakfast bagels in here, mm. eggs mm -hmm. and cheese. Make a little anything. Well, it comes with them little frying pan looking things. Look. Mm -hmm. It's like a little mini frying pan. Put something in there. Well, we could cook the eggs first, put them on our bagel, mm. and melt cheese on it, right? Yeah. Of course, you would add a little bacon, I guess. Yeah, that's what I forgot to put on here. <laughs> I know it. That's okay. We can make many more. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. Stop by again soon. Mm -hmm. Please subscribe. Stay safe and healthy. My back still hurts. Talk to you later. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> <laughs> you see oh, so good. <laughs> oh, <I'll> buy that. <laughs>